Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. Today we are going to lip swatch the Laura Mercier Velour Extreme Matte Lipstick Collection. Now this is not a new product, came out several months ago, but I did not realize there were quite so many colors until uh, I was in the Laura Mercier store a while back, pottering around and I was like, oh, I need to lip swatch this entire collection because I love the formula. Now the shade that I am wearing right now is called Soiree and unfortunately this is not part of the permanent collection. This came out uh, for their Spring Summer 2019 limited edition collection and it's just a beautiful shade. But this is what turned me on to the whole collection. So um, there are a couple of similar shades, orange tone shades, in the permanent lineup, which you will see in a while. This is an ultra matte lipstick formula that is meant to be long wear and also very intense. You get a dramatic matte finish and it's full coverage as well. The slim design also makes it pretty easy to control the application without a brush. You can use this on the go quite easily, I find. You don't really need a lip pencil with this because it doesn't bleed, it doesn't smear all over the place due to the matte formula. Now before I go straight into the swatches, I'm gonna let you know that I will be breaking down the colors by color groupings or categories just so you know if you're looking for a warm toned shade, you can just watch a certain section of the video instead of watching the whole thing. And uh, also, I think there are supposed to be 24 total shades in the entire collection, but I have 22 here with me, so I apologize for the two that are missing. That's just what happens sometimes. <laughs> I just have to pause to say some of these strange lighter orange tones are so weird in a cool way. They're kind of like creamsicle pastel oranges that look like they're not gonna work but somehow still do so...
just kind of melts with your body heat and then glides on but they do sort of have this interesting texture where they set after a while so even though they're not supposed to be non-transferring lipsticks you will start to feel a little bit of a drag across your lips after a few minutes when the layer that's already on your skin starts to dry and lock down on your skin so um, can you see there is hardly even anything on my finger and I didn't apply this, you know, more than a minute ago just to do this outro. So I highly recommend this if you like a formula that is kind of very smooth and velvety when it glides on, gives you high pigmentation, can be sheared out, but you need to work fast. Now, of course, there were a couple of shades that took a little bit more work or would look a little bit patchier on your lips, especially if you have paler lips like me. But it's not an uncommon issue, especially with dark purple toned shades. And I experienced that with a lot of brands, even the really expensive stuff like Pat McGrath's Matte Trans lipsticks. L'Oreal's um, Colorish Matte lipsticks come a little bit closer to the pigmentation level of these but again they don't really have um, this ultra matte ultra intense finish so I really don't think there is an exact formula or texture dupe from a drugstore brand at this point in time nothing that's exactly this intense and this matte looking on the lips or this long lasting seriously this is amazing um, in terms of like basic very light touches it will not come off at all of course, the shade range is fantastic. Uh, I don't think I met a real dud in terms of the colors in the line. My only critique uh, in terms of color range would be that there is only one single sort of a beigey nude shade, which is Vibe. Uh, of course, I only swatched 22 out of the 24 total shades, so maybe the two that I'm missing in my set are nudes. I don't know at this point, and I'll need to go check that out. Anyway, that brings me to the end of the video again. I hope you guys have a great rest of the week. If you like this, please give me a like. If you are new here, please subscribe and I will see you in the next one. Bye!